got into stained glass because I went into some churches and I kept asking, well, how come there's never any black folks on these windows in churches, you know? And I said, is, is it hard to make black people? He says, no, people just didn't want them. So I started making black people in stained glass windows. And then I started making jazz images uh, in stained glass. I uh, listen to a lot of music when I'm actually working on a particular piece. And by listening to the music, I try and feel what they were feeling at the time when they were playing it. One artist always inspires you to learn about somebody else. Charles Mingus, Miles Davis, Coltrane, Chad Baker, uh, Bill Evans. It's like it didn't stop. It's like a domino effect. It just keeps going and going and going. I try and make him not always so serious looking, but you know, that you can look at it and see the life coming through the glass. But I think me working on the quilt, so working on a piece of glass, and then reading about them when I'm working on them, I kind of have a feeling that I have met them. I do know them.